charge is negative as well as positive. That's why you could do goal setting or goal creation or goal smoothness through aspectics. And the idea is to remove the positive charge. You think, why would I want to remove the positive charge? We're always trying to remove the negative charge, right? Well, why we go for the negative charge is because we as humans are conditioned to think that the negative side is negative. Right? So too is that positive side. It's not negative, but it can also lock you. It can also, the incessant push to be in a positive state. Whereas when you're in the Tao, you're just naturally with it. You're, you're naturally fluid with reality. You're like Tai Chi master. You don't have to go, okay, let's do it. And you don't have to go, woe is me. I can't do it. Right? That's what happens between the back and forth. Drumming up, crushing down. Drumming up, knocking down. We want to get to equilibrium. We want to get to it where we don't have to have excessive facades. Spacious non-duality or dynamic stillness is another name for it. Another name we give this. Dynamic stillness. Because it's still, but it's not floppy still. It's potentiality. It's the quantum field. It's the source of where things spring out of. The implicate order is really where we're going here.